Hello everyone, Jazz Bragler here from vbulletin.com and today I wanted to show you how to easily and quickly upgrade your vbulletin community using a command line through an SSH and Telnet client called Putty. So in order to upgrade from the command line you need to 1. Back up your site. This is the most important step to any upgrade process. 2. Secure shell access or a SSH access for short and if you are unsure please ask your host provider if this is available to you. And third is an SSH and Telnet client called PuTTY. So to download PuTTY, just go on Google and type in PuTTY client download and click on the first result. And you should be taken to the PuTTY download page. And here it will show you a number of versions you can download. And I would just download the PuTTY.exe under the binaries for Windows for Windows on Intel x86 and I'd also like you to take note that this type of upgrade will only work if you are upgrading your website to vBulletin version 4.1 plus so if you are upgrading your site to any version besides version 4.1 and above this upgrade process is not relevant so what are the benefits of upgrading your community using the command line well there are two one if you have a community with a huge database, your internet or server connection might disconnect and timeouts may occur, doing it the default upgrade way. So by using the command line, the process of upgrading will remove timeout delays because you are upgrading directly from the server itself, not through your internet connection. So it will be a smoother process. And the second benefit is that it is uh, faster than the default way. And of course, Given that you know what you are doing, this will be very quick. <laughs> so for this tutorial, I will be upgrading my vBulletin test site version 4.1.0 to the latest stable version 4.1.1. And I've already uploaded all the files via FTP and all I need to do now is upgrade via command line. And so to begin, open up your SSH and Telnet PuTTY client and log into your website. And as you can see, I'm already logged into my account. So what I need to do next is connect to the install directory because this is where the upgrade.php file is. So I'll type in cd space and I need to know the full path to the location of the install directory. And if you don't know, you can download a script which is provided in the description of this video and upload it to the install directory folder. So if you're watching this on another site besides youtube.com or vbulletin.com, please visit this video through our YouTube channel and read the description and click the link. And this is what the script basically does. It tells you the exact path to a directory. So I'll just copy this and paste this into the PuTTY client and press enter. So after you've successfully done that and you are in your install directory, type in php space dash f space upgrade dot php and enter. And it will begin the upgrade process as soon as you press enter. Now, depending on the size of your vBulletin site, it may take a while, so please be patient. And I'll just fast forward this video to the next part of the upgrade process. Okay, so as you can see, the upgrade is complete and was successful. So all I have to do now is go back to my vBulletin forum and check to see if it has been updated. Yep. I am now running on 4.1.1. Congrats, you've successfully upgraded your vBulletin website via command line. So anyways, if you've enjoyed this video tutorial, please subscribe and check back for more. We will constantly add new videos to our channel. Enjoy!